one. I'm joined right now by Cal State LA men's basketball, coming off a 75 to 73 win over the number two seed Cal State Dominguez Hills in the semifinal round of the 2024 CCA men's basketball tournament. I'm joined right now by head coach Jim Saya on his right, Corey Cofield, and on his left, Shane Bell. Coach, would you give us your thoughts on today's game? You know, first off, we're a team of faith, so all glory goes to God. We're just so appreciative of being here. I know it's the first day of Lent, too, so uh, we're just grateful and appreciative of you. Just to be interviewed here, we're just having a blast, so thank you very much. I do have to follow up on the next one. Give us your thought on this highly competitive game. It came down to the very end. I'm sure you have a lot of thoughts. My emotions are still running high. So. Yeah, I, I was my emotions, I haven't calmed down yet. I really am not going to give a good answer. It was just a hard-fought game to play somebody three times against a high-quality team like Dominguez and Beta. But we just fought, and we just believe. I think that's that we just believe in, in what our team can do. And uh, this guy made the big-time play. Uh, and he got the big time rebound. And so you win with players at this time of year. You know, the coaching's out of it. There's no secrets. And uh, this is just a team that wills itself to win. Shane, I'd like to talk to you about what I saw as a little bit of momentum and what I thought was a very impressive play. You guys had the lead the entire game. They come back and take the lead with about three minutes to go. Could you tell me about that sequence that you guys really responded after leading the whole game and how you guys kind of fought through and made sure to maintain that advantage? Uh, yeah, it's been like something like our kind of like our uh, Achilles heel, like just staying poised in every situation. There's been a couple of times where we've had a lead, lost the lead, and then we kind of just break down. But today we really pulled together as a team and just stayed calm. Corey, I'd like to talk to you once again. You, you might see somebody have 73 points out there on the board, but you guys seem like you guys had a lot of aggressive defense out there. There was a lot of hands. Can you tell me about the defensive effort the Golden Eagles had tonight? <clears throat> I mean, that's our identity is defense. No, we gotta fall back on that every time. If we don't play deep, we're not going to win no championship, no games, no nothing. You know, and it just comes down to that. Shane, let me talk to you. I'm gonna have you kind of as one of the orchestrators of the offense out there. Yeah. You look through that box score, and I'm sure you see five players in double figures. Yeah. Tell them about the balanced scoring attack and how you helped get all your teammates involved in this situation. Uh, yeah, uh, running our offense, everybody's touching the ball. Like that's when we're at our best. Everybody's scoring. Nobody is like me, me, me. We just all winning want everybody to, you know, do well uh, to win the game. They're able to get, turn the team over so many more times. So, I mean, it's very important. You know, we turn it over, we get more possessions, they get less possessions. You know, we get more attempts at the you know, points. You know, it's just pretty much, it's pretty much that, honestly. Just, you know, make them force turnovers and then we take care of the ball. Fantastic. Coach, let me just ask you the final one. Like you said, you played this team just about a week ago or something yeah, like that. Yeah. Just how hard is it to, to go with these types of games? And once again, that one came down, I think, to a final possession as well. It came right. down, and, and we have a lot of respect for Dominguez and Steve Becker. They've had a tremendous season, but uh, to beat the league champs three times, and you know, but we're not done. I mean, you know, we're, we're, we want to, you know, obviously advance to the NC two ways, but uh, we got one more game tomorrow, and uh, you know, we we won without our, our best player, probably one of our uh, Eche on the floor. And we were in foul trouble, so it really was a team win. And, and other people stepped back, like a Johnny Levius was just tremendous today. And uh, and so we really have guys that step up, Isaiah Fields and Chris. Crow. We have a total team, and everybody plays their role. And sometimes that happens. You get in foul trouble, and it was just a tremendous team win. Well, thank you very much, and congratulations on getting to the finals. We can't wait to see you guys tomorrow. We don't know who you're going to play yet. You guys can play the winner of Cal State San Bernardino and uh, Cal State East, uh, East Bay, who's playing right now. But you guys' championship game will be tomorrow night at 8 o'clock. We can't wait to see you then. We need the rest. <laughs>